The Presidential Task Force on COVID-19 has issued new directives imposing five weeks restrictions on activities involving large gatherings, while government member staff on grade level 12 and below are to work from home. Mr. Boss Mustafa, chairman of the PTF and secretary to the government of the Federation, made this known at the national briefing in Abuja. His Excellency President Muhammad Buhari, the President of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, having considered our recommendations as authorized the PTF to engage with states and the FCT to assume full ownership of this stage of the response by deploying legal structures and resources, including enforcement to manage the pandemic within their jurisdictions. In line with the authorization, the PTF wishes to issue the following advisories to the subnational entities, meaning the states, for implementation over the next five weeks, because these activities are considered super spreader events. We would be presenting to the states our advisories with regards to A, to consider closing all bars, nightclubs, pubs, and event centers, and recreational venues for the next five weeks. Close all the restaurants except those providing services to hotel residents, takeaways, home deliveries, and driving shall also be expected to be closed. Restrict all informal and formal festivity events, including weddings, conferences, congresses, office parties, concerts, seminars, sporting activities, end of year events, to a number of 50 persons as much as they can. D, limit all gatherings linked to religious events to less than 50% capacity of the facility of use during which physical distancing, mandatory use of face masks shall be strictly enforced. Where more than 50 persons are attending any such events, the gathering as an advisory should be held outdoors as much as possible to limit or prevent the spread of COVID-19. Public transportation systems are to carry passengers not more than 50% of their capacities in compliance with social distancing rules. We we'll also advise the subnational entities to enforce compliance with the non-pharmaceutical protocols, especially the advisory on the wearing of masks in public places, particularly office environments. I just want to reinstate that these are not new protocols that we have put in place. They've existed all this while, but we want the subnational entities now to take greater and stronger measures and responsibilities because we are at the stage of serious community transmission as evidenced by the figures that we've had in the last couple of weeks. And two, to reduce overcrowding in public places, markets, shopping centers, offices, and schools, states are advised to implement the following. Encourage virtual meetings in government offices. All government staff on grade level 12 and below are to work from home for the next five weeks. Permanent secretaries and chief executives are to be held accountable for enforcing MPI rules in their domains with frequent sport checks.